Alright, so after watching the previous video about road curve, many have asked about the radius up curve, which means where does the radius up curve come from, okay? So this is the question asked many times by viewers in the comment section and I'm gonna answer this guy today, okay, in this episode. Alright, so it actually depends upon the uh, different parameters up curve, okay? like uh, on the deflection angle and the cut up curve and the middle denate and especially on the design speed okay so these factors are involved in the determination of curve radii so uh, in the basic design criteria uh, there are few tables okay like this one as you can see this table does have the values for the radius of curve okay uh, like as you can see these are in the mile per hour and this guy represents the uh, table in the measurements MK system okay th th this one is uh, in the MK system which means the design speed is in the kilometer per hour and these values the radius okay these are in the meters all right so as you can see these are based on the emx eight percent and a reference to uh, ashto okay our uh, american association of states highway and transportation official all right so just look at this guy 45 uh, mile per hour is the design speed so the usual and the absolute video must be uh, 755 okay per the radius these are in the field and uh, absolute video is 600 feet okay per the curve radius and in the kilometer if you look to the design speed at 70 okay so the minimum radius of curve can be taken is 220 okay meters or 175 uh, which is a absolute value minimum okay per the curve radius in meters all right so these are the values okay this table can be reviewed per any uh, you can say uh, design speed okay uh, if you don't find the video uh, in the same table you can of course just uh, work out the uh, video of radii uh, by using the ratio method or proportion okay like for example if, if you look to the table there is no video which may be equal to 30 or 20 okay kilometer per hour there is no video it starts from 70 so you can work that okay by using the ratio method so let me just go down a little bit over here as you can see these are based on e max six percent okay and going down a little bit uh if you look to the all right just wait a minute all right these guys okay these are the design speeds and the minimum radius table a radii table just look at this when you have a crown of two percent and e max eight percent okay so these are uh, the road design manual and the basic design criteria. But however, if you have different parameters, uh, you can of course calculate the radius of curve by using the formulas. All right. Just look at this guy. If you have the curve and middle denate of the curve, of course you can use this formula, okay, which is a square plus h square divided by 2h. Uh, and this must be equal to the uh, curve radius. Okay. So this is it if you have these uh, parameters known okay you can use this formula or uh, in case if you have of course the apex distance you can use of course r times secant of deflection half okay minus one which must be the apex distance you can um, just rearrange the formula for the radius of the curve and so on if you have the middle than it of course you can arrange this uh, formula if you have of course the curve length okay if this is known you can of course use this formula and rearrange it for the radius all right and so on just go ahead if you have the card tangent length etc you can re rearrange these formulas okay and i have already explained these formulas in the previous video you can watch that the video is already been uploaded in the same playlist in the same channel okay and the another thing which you can use of course if you have the degree of curve okay if the degree of curve is known of course you can use uh, 1720 divided by d to determine the radius of curve in meters and in case if you need to determine the curve radius in feet of course you can use the same formula okay that is r equals uh, 5730 divided by d here d represents the degree of curve so my main focus was to follow this table 
and indeed if you are a designer you don't of course need to follow these types of tables okay a designer always do trials and then check the video if it is okay for the save operation then that is approved okay and uh, if it's not okay many changes are been done okay by the designer and if you look to the table as you can see when the speed that is the design speed increases of course the radii must increase and the uh, super elevation is decreased okay so this is basic all right so this is how we take the curve radius or we design the radii of curve hey if you like these types of videos please hit that subscribe button press the bell icon and never miss an update from engineer boy thank you dears for watching see you next time